your ass I am. It was a Tuesday morning. I was in bed watching the tube with Puss. You know, Puss, ever since Charlie's Angels, I've wanted to get a how do you do from Lucy Lou. I, not Lucy Lou. Yeah, but you're every bit as beautiful as Lucy Lou. Ah, you're Bing. I ring. I shishien. Ah, Evans, you're so sweet. Yeah, sweet and sour, baby. Puss, I can say you take my breath away in 67 languages. Damn it, except for Dutch. I'll get it, Puss. Ah, Evans here. Evans, you promised I'd have a chance to exercise my acting chops. Well, I read the script, and it sucks. It was just a first draft, baby. Believe me, you'll be able to stretch. You're the best. Who is this? It's Sharon Stone, and I'm out of your stupid movie. I'm an actress, goddammit. I've won a Golden Globe. Goddamn Golden Globes. You know who picks a puss? Six Pollocks sitting around a table at the Warsaw Cafe, gulping down their potato soup. Uh-huh. I've got a show I'm taking to Broadway. Ever heard of the vagina monologues? Well, I never quite got into the porno game, Sharon. Me? I don't like to commute to the valley. It's theater, you dumb shit. And I'm doing all three parts myself. I'm calling it Sharon Stone's Vagina. Bad news. You bet your ass it was. Someone put it into that starlet's head that she could act. <laughs> Sharon Stone's vagina. We've all seen it. It can't act either. <laughs> Tully May, I got trouble big. That slut just dropped out of my movie. I handle the house business, not the movie business. Bullshit. Where's English? That crazy butler's out buying most cedar chips to put in the closet with your damn cashmere suits. No wonder we ain't got no money for a new egg beater. Good. I don't dig eggs, but I sure dig cashmere. Now I need you to drive me down to the Crunch Gym. Julia Roberts always works out there, and I'm going to work on her. She's perfect for the part. That's not part of my job description. This ain't no driving, Miss Daisy. Now that was a great picture. Another Academy Award for Team Evans. Mr. Evans, you didn't produce that damn picture. Sure I did. Well, then I must have passed on it. That Morgan Freeman can come in here and bake my bread in a day of the week, except for Sunday, because y'all know that's Denzel's. Goodbye, Tally Mae. <laughs> Not such a bad driver, am I, Puss? <laughs> Don't worry, Puss, I got it. <laughs> Ladies, hello. What have you done to my studio, Dunkoff? The best mind clean ich. Ich bin lachen. Oh. I want you to make love to me in positions suggested by Herr Joseph Pilates. Damn it, it's the coppers. Uh, be cool, Puss. Just cool. I can handle them coppers. <laughs> Officer, what can I do for you? License and registration, please. You got it. The name's Franklin. Ben Franklin. Is that some kind of bribe? You bet your sweet black motor speedy ass it is. Don't worry, puss. I've been in many jails many times. On many sets. You ready to get cut, bum-ass bitch? Yo, back off! He's my indigent bitch! Bitch! Hey, cool out, brother. Pick on someone your own size. Wait a minute, I know you. You're Robert Evans. You bet your ass I am. I had a three-picture deal when you were president of Paramount. Uh-uh. I never did hobo pictures, pal. There's no money in them. I'm sick of listening to you punk-ass, bitchy-ass bitches talk. Yo, he's mine, bitch! Well, let's throw down, bizzle-ass, bizzly-ass bitch. When it kills the honky. <laughs> Puss, I love this. I feel like I'm on the set of some West Side Story. Uh-huh. I'm a serial killer, snap, crackle, pop, had two scoops of your sister, and let my load drop, bitch. Damn. 
Your mom's tried to deep throat my chocolate bologna, but she couldn't cause I'm hung like Sonny Corleone. Ah! <laughs> Sonny Corleone? That's from The Godfather. What do you punks know about The Godfather? Uh, it's only a cinematic masterpiece that took the gangster genre and elevated it to operatic heights, bitch. What do you know about The Godfather? This is Robert Evans. He produced The Godfather. One and two. Oh, yo, you better not have produced three. Three? I never get within a mile of that piece of shit. My bad, dog. Oh, man, I had no idea. Plus, we gotta do some brainstorming. This dancing and rhyming, it's electric. But what do we do with it? Broadway? You're a genius, puss. If Sharon Stone's vagina can be at Broadway, why can't we? Here's the pitch. Hip-hop meets The Godfather. A smash Broadway musical starring you and the whole posse. What do you think, bros? Will you bail us out of jail? Whatever you want. Brother from another mother? <laughs> Good God, sir. I sped over here as soon as I heard. Uh, may I pour you a cosmopolitan? Good thinking, English. And pour around for all my bitches here, too. Right away, sir. Let's have a toast, dogs. We're gonna go to the Great White Way and we're gonna paint it black. Okay, okay. Come on, let's rehearse. T-Dog, you're the godfather. At 25 Cent, you're Michael Corleone. And it's your sister's wedding. Now, brother, hit me with that jive rap. Yeah, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Why is he the godfather? He's a punk-ass bitch! Stop bitching, you half-ass bitches. Come on. Have some gin and juice, will you? Enjoy yourselves. See them ladies out by the pool? <laughs> Their legs ain't closed. They're for us? Bought and paid for, brother. Enjoy it, you honey biz bitches. Puss, puss the crip. I'm so scared. <gasps> English, quit playing with that gun. It ain't no prop. What the hell are you doing, English? The doorbell's ringing. You can take a nap later. Right away, sir. Mr. Evans, we got big trouble at the front door. <laughs> are them gangsters fronting again? Yeah, but not the ones you think. It's the Italian investors for the Sharon Stone movie, and they want their money back. Now, are they gonna shoot the piano? Shall we take flight, sir? No chance. Yellow may be your color, Limey, but it ain't mine. Now, just watch. I'm gonna do a sill job on these olive oil leg breakers. Sounds risky, sir. Risky? When do I do anything that ain't? Mm, hello, my sweet mama. Name's Tyrone. What's your name? Don't waste your time, criminal. This girl, huh, she does not date gang-banging, gang-banger-ass gang bang. So there! Damn, that girl got style, boy. Mm, and a booty bigger than my Cadillac Escalade. Fellas, come on in, fellas. Come on in, sit down. Sit down. Hey, Fat Tony, you lost a lot of weight. Yeah, they got me on that Adkins sting. All the gabagool and mixed nuts I can eat. Boo! I'm down 30 pounds. Yeah? Well, you're still a fat piece of crap. Are right, we gonna get down to business with this Hebrew or what? Word on the street has it that that Sharon Stone movie's dead. We want our 20 million back. <laughs> oh dear, the Steinway! Hey, paisans, cool it, will you? I've got a new project that'll take you 20 mil and multiply it by 10. Give me my money right now or the waiter gets plugged. I will have you know that I am a butler and I... <laughs> Hold it, boys, will you, and listen up. I've got the rights to the impossible. A Broadway musical of The Godfather. You're still alive? Continue. All right, Evans. So who'd you get to be in his song and dance thing? De Niro? Pacino? Stallone? Uh, I was still casting. I don't know. Let me worry about that. You just worry about keeping Fat Tony off that pasta. I'm a carboholic. Hey, yo, Evans. Are we ready to rehearse this bitch? Bitch? Yeah, Holmes. I want to review my motherfucker motivation in this motherfucker wedding scene. Motherfucker? Bitch? Shh. Listen, fellas. I guess I'm Maui Waui hidden behind the tennis court. It's primo stuff. Now go get yourself F-E-D'd up. Wedding scene? Why was that Moulin Yan talking about a wedding scene? He's at welding. I'm teaching them a trade. Uh, I'm in the Big Brother program. Those kids are from the hot scrabble streets of Beverly Hills adjacent. Hey, 
It's nice to give something back. So what do you say, fellas? Godfather on Broadway. In or out? All right, we're in. English, show them out. Right this way, gentlemen. Ah! <coughs> fellas, right this way. Oh, the indignity. Well done, maestro. But what will happen when those toughs discover that your cast is entirely of the African-American persuasion? They'll kill me. Unless I make them a ton of dough. Keep your balls crossed, English, that we're a hit. Do you have any? Mr. Evans, you got a gift basket. It's full of delicacies and whatnot. I ate me that honey butter, so don't go looking for that. Your cholesterol, Tolly. Your cholesterol. I worry about that when I am dead. Right now, I'm hungry. Read the card, will you? See what's from. I can't wait to see you fall flat on your stupid face on Broadway. I hate you, Sharon Stone. I'm gonna take this Beaujolais and use it for my cooking. Beaujolais? Honey butter? That's a $25 basket from Costco. It's an insult. Shall we retaliate by sending Miss Stone one of those animals that bit off her husband's toe? <laughs> no, 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 no. I don't play that way. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna premiere the hip-hop godfather the same night Sharon Stone's vagina opens. <laughs> I'll close that thing once and for all. Yo, Evans, the ball machine ain't working. How's a brother supposed to work on his neck, gang? Ah, the Big Apple. We're only one week away from the premiere of the hip-hop godfather. Me? <laughs> I'll either be the toast of Broadway or I'll, I'll be toast. Well, things got a little heated at rehearsal this morning. A few of my actors shot each other, that's all. <laughs> so while my gang-banging bros were getting stitched up at Beth Israel Hospital, me, I took a shot at polishing up the music for the show. Fredo, my brother, I know it was you. You no good, dirty-ass mother scratches. Don't you be a hoochie-ass name-dropper. Paige. Hello, Evans. Word on the street is your show's in the crapper. Your cast keeps gunning each other down. It's a process. It's no worse than what you did to Billy Baldwin on Sliver. Serves you right for following me to Broadway. Nobody goes up against my vagina and wins. Yo, yo, I know you, bitch. Ain't you in the movies? Uh, I was in Casino. Didn't see it. Diabolique? Didn't see it. The Muse. The what? <sighs> Basic freaking instinct. That's it! I seen you downstairs. My stars. How are you, stars? Yo, Mr. E. Man, two of my boys got bullets lodged in their spines. <laughs> they paralyzed. That's terrible. Make a script note, puss. The Barzini clan are now in wheelchairs. Come on, guys. I want to show you the morgue where they view Sonny's body. It's a rib joint now. Nice do-rag, puss. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Luca Brazi sleeps with the fishes. You a pile of cheap shot. Bisley ass bitches. Fishes! Uh, cue the fishes. English, I think we are going to touch magic with this one. Scats is all black. Ain't none of me white. Except for what I left in your mom's last night. Oh, no, that's it. He did it. Trigger happy player haters. You, you, you can't kill your co-star. He ain't my co-star no more. Man, I quit. If he quit, I quit. Now cut it. You mothers can't quit. I've got 20 million reasons why this show must go on. What can I say, dog? Bloods and Crips, they just hate each other. That's the way of the world. Didn't you learn anything from the Godfather movies, man? When the families work together, you have strength and unity. When the families feuded, destruction. Has one good thing come out of your war with each other? Hells no! I just keep getting shot! Exactly. Then why the hell do you keep fighting? In the words of Vito Colleone, break the pattern and go legit. And by legit, I mean legit theater. I hear what you're saying, Mr. E. <sighs> Man, what do you say? You want to put down them Glocks and do this show, bitch? All right, bitch. That was magnificent, sir. You saved the show from a certain ruination. I don't know how you'd do it. It's called producing, English. 
Okay, now tell me, who got pushed high? Very funny, 25 cent. Put it away, will you? What's with his cast, pal? We're the Italians. Fellas, we've got a packed house. Gotta feel good to have a hit on your hands, doesn't it? We didn't pay for this Moulin piece of crap. Shut it down, now. Go to hell, you dumb goomba. This is America. Shut it down now, or you're dead. You know what, guys? First, you gotta catch me. When I roll, roll, pop Bullet to the brain With my clock, 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 clock Clock, clock, clock Oh dear The Godfather is about Italians Not black gangbangers The Godfather belongs to everyone, you dumb wop Loan shocking, prostitution, senseless killing You're all colorblind was that in the script? Huh? What script? Oh, who am I kidding? My vagina stinks. Well, dear boy, we did it again. We most certainly did, sir. You taking the bullet in the finale was a real crowd pleaser. Mr. Evans, them Italians sent you a get well basket full of nothing but meat and cheeses. Don't go looking for that prosciutto, because I done ate that up with some melon. <laughs> Once those goombas saw the box office receipts, they were falling all over each other to give me more bread for the sequel. Don't go looking for no bread in there neither. It's the Atkins diet. Crazy white diet doctors. A girl cannot live without her biscuits. Sir, shall I carve you a wedge of pepper cheese? <laughs> no thanks, English. But you could probably talk puss into it. She digs cheese. Evan's here. Hi, Bobby. It's me. How you feeling, baby? Feeling great. Getting better every day. You know, you're the best. Who is this? <laughs> you silly Billy. It's Sharon Stone. Listen, my agents gave me some terrible advice about your sniper movie. I can't wait to start filming. This broad's got bigger balls than Shaquille O'Neal. She shuts down my picture, almost gets me killed. <laughs> was I gonna let her back in my movie? You bet your ass I was. She's still a star. And me? I'm still a star producer. Puss. My, my shoulder, it's, it's, it's throbbing. Are you still Karen? Light it up. Being a winner in life ain't easy, but I'll give you a tip that should help big. Never underestimate your competition. Know their strengths. Ah, but far more important, know their weakest link. That's the key. What better example than Sharon Stone? It was that weak link that brought her to her knees. Her vagina. <laughs> now she purrs up to me like a pussycat. English, roll the film, will you? Kid Notorious, scene 3-8, take one. Being a winner in life ain't easy, but I'll give you a tip that should help big. <laughs> Bob, are you all right? <laughs> Jeff, get him a drink of water, please. <laughs> Would someone bring me something so I don't slide off my f***ing chair here? Jeff! He's the guy who slams the door shut on Sharon Stone's vagina. Ah, uh, that's the dumbest line I've ever heard in my life. Who wrote this crap? Uh, you did, Bob. I wrote it? Well, that is fantastic. Let's take it from the top. Wow. He did great. Hey! Let's do it!
Bye.